You all need to know about Napoleon cake. It's 12 layers of puff pastry dough, lots of custard cream. It's the king of all the cakes. The secret to perfect puff pastry dough is to keep the dough always cold, like super cold, ice cold. So go put this in the fridge. Then you'll need ice cold butter and flour. Dip the butter in flour and shred on the larger hole. Make a little volcano and pour our cold mixture in the center. Start mixing the dough and keep in mind we're not kneading the dough. We just want to collect all the pieces together. Split the dough into two and tightly seal it in a plastic wrap. Refrigerate the dough for at least two hours. Then split each square into six and roll each piece of the dough into a circle. Then cut out a perfect circle and these edges you'll use for the crumb coat. Make holes for even baking. Bake at 375 for 12 minutes. 12 layers and the crumb coat. To make the custard cream, combine yolks, sugar, salt, cornstarch, vanilla, and milk. Mix, you want to see no lumps. Transfer it to a pot on medium heat. You're gonna mix constantly until it starts to thicken. And when it looks like this, take it off the heat. Transfer it to a bowl, add butter and mix. With the plastic wrap, seal it well. We want no air at all and refrigerate for at least two hours. This looks so good. I'm obsessed with custard cream. Now we're gonna put the cake together. Use a lot of custard cream. Be very generous with it. The puff pastry layers are dry, so uh, like use a lot. And then remember those extra pieces we're gonna use for the crumb code. Okay, once you're done, you're gonna let the cake stand at room temperature for one hour and then refrigerate for like 12 hours at least before serving it. I already told you it's the king of all the cakes, so it will be good.